Hi everyone, this update about Bitcoin. So what we can expect and now that's what I'm here to talk about. If you still not yet subscribe the channel, subscribe the channel, press the like button, leave a comment. Join with us in our Facebook page, guys. You guys can ask any questions, anything if you have a doubt about the market. So I'm able to answer you individually. So right now, guys, what we're seeing and where I expected, you guys remember I already marked up the wave five price target. We already hit the minimum requirement that meaning uh, 1.216 FIP level so that is amazing so minimum FIP level is achieved the fifth wave so right now everyone concerning right now the time to pull back and the expectation level is here that is my resistance level so apart from that I would love to reduce that purple color line so the concern again to price to pull back here to pull back 25,000 it's a little bit harder according to the market situation so that's the concern it is going to be pulled back this is the level we're going to pull back that's for sure 27,000 so apart from that one I still I did not see the major pullback there is no story behind on it even inflation number is amazing we're seeing the total month on month inflation is dropped already uh five percentage that's amazing so that meaning we're seeing the inflation started to drop almost so previously we crossed that level in a 2021 october you know after october 2021 right now 2023 after two years almost 16 months uh, before we're seeing the inflation increasing right now we're seeing the inflation decreasing but apart from the inflation decreasing there is they should start it quantitative easing so that's the next thing and according to my view another rate hike is going to be in future i already explained till june july that in uh they're going to increase the rates after that they will start to cut from the beginning of the year i already explained so if you are in a long time with us you know that all the story what they're going to do in future so today if I show you only one thing market is pullback happened because year on year we are seeing the previous number is 5.5 so right now 5.6 that's become the negative that is the core CPI year on year and the CPI year on year it's dropped. So core CPI because of that we are seeing the stock market huge pullback after that. If I go to hourly chart, you guys can see the first before the inflation drop and is the negative impact because of year core CPI year on year after that it started to pull back and we seeing the reaction and in this two hours as I remember there is uh, two speech there I hopefully they talk about the next 25 percentage 25 basis point rate hike that is the reason we seeing the stock market pullback has happened and along with that the good news what we're seeing uh, Dixie chart also dropped and similar levels like before so previously we dropped after that almost go and hit 100, uh, 102 levels so before that we're seeing we already dropped 181 cent so right now we are very close to that level 181 so we can expect that that is the support level right now we are be holding previously here support if i show you here 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 we're seeing and here as well so we can expect a little bit bounce but it's not going to be the sustainable bounce right now the situation is very bad for dixie so what we're going to be uh in future we're going to see below uh 100 mark for dixie guys so that's going to be amazing opportunity to bitcoin to bounce so right now the way i expected already happened and i just want to zoom out a little bit the price is still holding one of my trend line you guys can see that trend line is how strong it is so first of all pull back and again we're seeing in uh, top of on the trend line again touch again bounce again touch at the last still trying to hold that the trend line but i don't think so this is strong enough to hold 
So my expectation is here 29,200 in case of we fake out from here 29,200 and the next large of strong support level is here 29,089 that's my purple color box head. So sorry so right now you guys can see how the price is bounced when we move above retest that particular level if I assume our exact levels so that meaning that the price target and the price is very meaningful you guys can see here first pullback is happened again touch exact the price target 29,290 and the pullback is happened for my purple color box head again it started to bounce so that meaning my targets are amazing so that's what i'm saying i'm not talking about this have going to happen something in the very next minute that is take time it's going to happen anyhow that's what i just want to explain you so right now concern i already explained the minimum requirement to price to hold in this between 29,900 and 28,798 in case of we lost that the price supposed to be end with here somewhere here back to the channel so the back to the channel we can expect it to bounce in somewhere here in this line that is the second chance to bounce back in case of highly unlikely we seeing the price drop below them that next target is possible is 26,300 maximum the price could drop in between uh, 26,300 and the 25,038 still I don't believe price could land there so I don't see that much weakness in the market and the next thing the happiest person in the world right now Michael Saylor you guys can see already four point one seven billions average price we have already 140,000 Bitcoin so imagine guys what is the average price is 29,803 is the smartest person I seeing in this business so right now he started to accumulate from the bottom and whatever the excess crash so he already recovered his losses so he already recovered he's already whatever the loss so right now he's going to enter the huge bull market imagine guys from here the price touched 300,000 so almost 10x gain so that meaning Michael Saylor or Mike uh, micro strategy company they're going to hold 40 billion dollar worth of Bitcoin imagine their capital is going to gain like crazy so one day in case of it's going to be 1 million per Bitcoin so how much they going to hold you cannot identify where the price going to be people predicting is going to be the 10 million also so in case of the price hit 10 million I hopefully the micro strategy is going to be the largest cap company and the highest uh, almost 14 trillion it's going to be then the ma uh, market cap going to be for uh, micro strategy it's going to be amazing so that's what he wants that is the huge strategy that's what he's planning to do imagine when the according to that the market cap so their share price is going to jump like about 1 million for sure so right now if you like to buy micro strategy uh, stocks that is also one of benefit like you holding bitcoin so that is one of thing i'm planning to do because i love to buy micro strategy company stocks because to invest the low risky because they are all the bitcoin risk under with them so i don't have any risk with that because they're going to hold that one in case of the bankruptcy they're going to pay back for me that is the reason so and the next thing i already talk about he's already still in the profit you guys remember uh, 29,803 right now price is 29,869 by the way so concerning this bounce and it's take little bit time I hopefully we we can see the price should pull back inside this particular levels and pull back again 
to inside the channel that what we're going to see in future because of the fear and tomorrow we are going to see ppi numbers producer price index and we'll see how the initial jobless claims is work so we need to check it out that one and after that we can decide the market where to going to be head so this is all about the bitcoin guys i hopefully are, uh, you love this update and uh, this is the proof i gave it to you before and still i really love to bitcoin to bounce till 20 uh, 34000 so that's going to be amazing and then we will uh, be going to see the altcoin season and the bitcoin move sideways so till the time bitcoin did not touch the 34000 we're never going to see the altcoin season guys and still i did not get any update about the ethereum shanghai update in in case of if i get any update about that i will update you guys thank you very much have a lovely day be safe